Okay, find out if the noise in your workplace is hazardous. Ask your supervisor and health and safety reps about risk assessments and noise exposure monitoring reports that may affect you. Also cooperate with your employer in terms of any lawful instruction given to you for health and safety. This includes getting involved in conducting risk assessments, particularly in your area of work or task. If you are required to, to wear noise monitoring equipment, do not tamper with it. Do not spend unnecessary time in a noise zone. If you are going for audiometric tests, do not expose yourself to noise outside the workplace before your test. Also, ask for feedback and an explanation of your results of the audiometric test from the occupational health practitioner performing the test. Wear your hearing protection devices correctly when you are entering a noise zone, as well as make sure that your colleagues are also wearing theirs correctly. So lastly, hearing loss is not reversible. However, with today's hearing loss prevention strategies and technologies, work-related hearing loss can be entirely prevented. As employees, we need to take responsibility for our own health and safety and cooperate with employers in reducing exposure to noise in the workplace.